Okay guys, what we're going to be doing today is I'm going to show you how to boil water inside a plastic container. You're obviously going to need a plastic bottle like this. And you want to fill it up to about here. That way whenever it starts to boil, it doesn't boil over the top and you lose some of the water. And also you want to remember that you're going to want to keep this either suspended above the fire like that, or you're going to want to keep it on the coals to boil it. The reason is, is because you don't want the fire to reach up here to where the water isn't at. Where your water line stops, if fire gets past it, it has a tendency to melt all the plastic. You don't really want that. But I'm going to do the uh, coal method. I'm going to let this finish burning down some coal and put this on it and show you guys how that is. Just keep watching. Okay guys, we put the water on the, on those coals there. You can see the flames are going a little bit high, but it's not too bad. As long as they don't reach above that water line, it's fine. But you can see on that other side over there that, that it has melted a little bit. That's what I'm talking about, guys, whenever I say you don't want to get it too close to the flames because that can happen. So we're just going to move this over here. Just kind of pile those coals a little closer to it. So we'll let this go a little bit longer, then I'll come back. Okay guys, it's starting to boil pretty good now. Side's got burnt up a little bit, I let it get up a little bit too high, but if that happens you can just pour a little bit of the water out. You don't really want to, but sometimes you have to. I'm going to pull this off guys and be right back. Okay guys, this is the following day. I ran out of light. As you can see whenever I was, whenever it started to boil, it was getting pretty dark. So I just decided to finish this up the next day. This is pretty much the finished product. You can see it doesn't look like it used to, but it still holds water just fine. See it. Got some hair on it from something, I don't know what that is, but no holes, it holds water just fine. And it don't taste bad, I mean it kind of tastes a little different, but it's not horrible. It's kind of like this typical watery boil on a campfire. But it's pretty simple to do. Just remember what I told you before. Don't fill it up all the way, just fill it up to about, to about here. Keep the flame below the water line. And it's, that's pretty much it. It's not too complicated, but a lot of people think that it's just going to melt just by putting it on the fire. That's what I used to say before I started trying this stuff. So Just remember to get out and try these things. Don't just watch it on TV or see a video on YouTube and think you know how to do it. Just get out and actually do it. Thanks for watching my video, guys. I appreciate it. Subscribe and I'll have a lot more like it.